Oh yeah. Bowser. Whew. It's the day before we leave. It was Wednesday. And we got some stuff to do. Also get to ops check the uh, AC in Bowser because I serviced her up yesterday. And uh, gotta make sure it works. Cause like I said, no AC on the way to Vegas in the summer is just not gonna happen for me, hopefully. We're headed right now over to James's house. And James lives on the other side of the world. So we'll go over there. We're gonna be borrowing some rims. Borrowing more rims. <laughs> James is uber nice to me, so I don't know why. We're going to throw a set of, I have some Cooper Cobras that might be slightly larger than the tires that are on it right now. Hopefully they fit. Uh, but we're gonna throw them on some wheels that he has for some burnout tires or as the Australians say, skid tires for some skids. Fucking skids! I think we're going white, white out or white in? <laughs> Let's say white out. White out even with the five, no. the five spoke chromes, white out? Uh, black out. Black out, okay. We're going black out. It looks like we're putting tires up all together for like a 68 Malibu that's going to the car show. <laughs> Not a 75 Pacer that's going to a burnout contest. <laughs> I think they'll look kind of good though. Hell yeah. Oh, there's our plug. Hold up. That'll burn off fine. I wonder if it gets really hot if it just comes out. Take a knife and put it down further. Yeah. All right, I'll try to cut it down. That's a little bit better. What do you think? What's optimal burnout PSI, James? 32, 32. <laughs> Let's do it. Just left James's. Uh, really appreciate getting those things mounted up. Thanks, man. Makes life a lot easier. Save some money, save some time. Got to hang out and bullshit. We were kind of talking about like uh, the future for the channel in the next couple months, even, um, and then the rest of this year, like just different ideas and uh, things that uh, have been kind of brewing like in my mind and his mind just bouncing stuff off each other so i'm pretty excited to see where it goes um and i'm glad that you guys are here but you know anyways we'll focus right now i guess on still getting to ls fest which is happening right now <laughs> uh, i'm gonna make one more stop on the way home minimum and right now we're gonna get I, when i bought the truck i didn't get any keys for the camper show so we're gonna get some keys made or bought or whatever for the shell so that way it can throw stuff in the bed um, for like the jack tools fuel uh, canisters fuel cans whatever you want to call it um, all that good shit man <laughs> yeah So we need to test fit these tires really quick, see if they fit or what. That way uh, we know if we're good for the burnout contest.
I need to get this thing out of here to look at this. The pacemaker might like be a do no wrong car for me because that thing looks thing looks really good. <laughs> you might do no wrong for me, pacemaker. I kinda like that. It looks fat too. Ah, come on, come on, let's get it out of here. pick up my buddy actually this is the street that I grew up on I grew up on that house right on down there kind of crazy but uh grab him maybe go for a ride still need to go to the hardware store got a couple pulls in getting some good data we'll see but everything seems happy the car's running good um I think that tonight I need to bleed the brakes really well with Katie um because we're losing some brake pedal as the day gets hot and then check out the plugs maybe get a set of plugs Put some fresh ones in. Boom. Fresh. Two deaths. All right, we got the the best homie, T Dub. Tyler, welcome. <laughs> we just hit Ace, cause Ace is the effing place. Kind of not really. I just say that because that's what they say. But uh, Mark says that. Mark says that. So we're going to go hit O'Reilly, get some brake fluid, and then uh, some plugs, some fresh plugs for this beast, and head back to the house. Nothing too crazy, but we might try to see if the uh, air fuels are good and see what kind of boost we're making because I turned it up a little bit. And then uh, Tyler hasn't ridden. We were just talking. He's been my friend since fourth grade. Fourth. Yeah. Fourth, Damn. fourth and a half. Fourth and a half grade. Fourth and a half grade. And he befriended me even though I had a broken arm, which was rad. Thrashed my arm, bro. It was bro. more of a pity, but yeah, it turned into, <laughs> a, it turned into a healthy relationship. Healthy-ish, besides all the hateful talk. But <laughs> now we're going to uh, see if he enjoys the go fast. I think the last one you were in we just talked about was the Chevelle from way back, and that thing was not fast, so. Apparently. Apparently. The Allegedly. Chevelle, not fast. Imagine that. Allegedly. You gotta be ready when you have a car like this. You have to be ready for people to talk to you. <laughs> you have to, otherwise you're just gonna be a jerk. Or you're just a dick, but in your case, you're just a dick anyways. Right, I'm a dick either way. So what did we just do? You just switched the tuning settings? Yeah, so I went in and I uh, upped the boost. Slightly, however much, I don't know, because I just pushed that screw in on the manual boost controller. And then uh, I made sure to add, like, I think I added like 20% up top past where we've been. Even though I've already been adding up there, I just want it to be super fat. That way when I get into it, it hits a wall of fuel and then I can back off from there. But I know that I'm good, you know what I mean? Because you won't want to get up in there and be lean.
quarter mile stretch between two shops. <laughs> it's like, holy shit, can I take a picture of this? <laughs> the dude uh, outside Ace. He's yeah. just like, staring at it like, why? <laughs> friends for so long and we're into a lot of the same things to some point but we're kind of like we always talk like the little where those little circles that overlap the overlapping <laughs> circles like there's things in the middle that we're so like similar on and we're into and then there's just some oddball things that we each kind of always <laughs> showed each other and it's really fun to take someone that um like you like you said you enjoy it like cars are cool but it's just it's not your priority to worry about building these or doing this when we take you for a ride and it's just like wow <laughs> like this is cool you know what I mean? this is what you do with your time <laughs> all right all right i see you i see you this is what you do with your time and all your money that you don't have and <laughs> things that you should be able, you should be doing other shit but this is cool oh dude that's what passion is right i mean doing the things that aren't necessary but you just love doing them so this is a hundred percent unnecessary yeah but it's a hundred percent necessary percent passion that's what i see <laughs> And shoot, now uh, I gotta take Richie rock climbing and put his ass on a hundred foot clip next and <laughs> put him in my shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I don't think they'd fit. <laughs> big foot. <laughs> yeah, a little bigger, but you know. I'll do you know it. What I they say about big feet, big socks. <laughs> oh, shut <up. laughs> 